In this video, I'm going to be teaching you all about clipping masks and alpha layers and how you can use both clipping masks and alpha layers to create a design just like this one. We are just going to have to draw these illustrations now. So I'm going to draw these and then I will speed it up for you guys too. So now that we have our illustration all in one layer, we are going to use a clipping mask to get this to clip to this shape. So you'll click on your layer like that, and then you will click on clipping mask. There you go. Another way that you can recolor your artwork is by creating a layer above an art, a piece of artwork, and then you will click on it and clipping mask so it changes the color of that layer right so now we'll clipping mask that and that's how that looks that way so that's how you can add an illustration you already have pre-made um, and how to change the color of that illustration so another way we can do this is we're going to click on alpha lock right here which means that anything that we paint or draw outside of this shape will not happen. So let's maybe grab one of these pattern brushes. Let's do, let's do this pattern right here. Okay. So that's how pretty that looks. And it just makes it really easy to add patterns, add different little illustrations to different shapes. So that's one way that you can use it as well. So we have that design. And then we are just going to create a pattern over it. So this is one of my favorite ways to use clipping masks is to just do one of these fun patterns right over it. Let's use these hearts. So right now we're just painting these hearts on, right? We're just going to draw them on. So this is one way to do it. And then we're going to use the clipping mask feature. See how that one worked right there. Or... So we can keep that as is, or I'll leave that one on here. We can do it another way over here. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side and do it this other way. Yeah, let's use the same brush. Let's change the color of it here. Let's do this yellow. We are going to go ahead and click this layer right here, and we're going to click Alpha Lock. And then it will only draw on that layer where we have already pre-drawn. So you can see in here that it's not in between those brush strokes at all. It's just right there. So this is a super fun way to get creative with different patterns and different types of designs to really make your designs pop in Procreate. And here's one more trick that I love doing when I'm working with a clipping mask is this one's really fun with this floral design because we can actually take this letter and we're just going to make it the exact same color as the background. Okay, but it's still there. You can still see it on this right here. So now we are going to, I'm going to create, I'm going to make this really dark blue. So again, we're going to fill, color fill. And then we're going to clipping mask to change the color of those floral designs. And now we still have, we still have this S as you can see right here, and it's in the same background color. So we're going to keep that there, and then we're going to go ahead and clipping mask this on top of the S. And then you get your design, and it's more of an outlined shape instead of the design on top of another color. So this is another one of my favorite ways to use clipping masks in Procreate. I hope you found this video helpful. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next week with another tutorial.